the Albert's trial investigated the effects of very early mobilization after a stroke. Early mobilization involves out-of-bed sitting, standing and walking during the first days after a stroke. While recommended in many practice guidelines, early mobilization was not supported by strong evidence. Proponents argue that early mobilization is important for brain plasticity and that bed rest may slow recovery by causing immobility-related complications. Opponents argue that early mobilization can be harmful, including reducing cerebral blood flow when the head is raised and increasing blood pressure with activity. The aim of this trial was to estimate the effect of very early mobilization compared to with usual care on disability in people with stroke. Participants were recruited in 56 acute stroke units from five countries. The main inclusion criteria were being aged over 18 years with an ischemic or hemorrhagic stroke and being admitted within 24 hours of stroke one set. 2,104 people agreed to participate. 1,054 were randomized to receive very early mobilization and 1,050 to receive usual care. Allocation was consumed. The very early mobilization group began treatment within 24 hours of stroke onset. Early mobilization focused on sitting, standing and walking, included at least three additional out-of-bed sessions Intervention was provided by trained physiotherapists and nurses. The intervention lasted 14 days or until discharge from the stroke unit. They also received usual care. The usual care group received the care usually provided in the treatment site. The primary outcome was the incidence of having a favorable outcome at three months post-stroke. A favorable outcome was defined as having a modified ranking scale score of 0 to 2 points, that is, no or minimal disability. Assessors were blinded to group allocation and analysis were by intention to treat. 46% of participants had a favorable outcome in the very early mobilization group compared with 50% in the usual care group. Very early mobilization reduced the odds of a favorable outcome at three months compared to usual care, with an adjusted odds ratio of 0.73. The 95% confidence interval was 0.59 to 0.90, a lower dose out of bed activity regimen early after a stroke is preferable to very early, frequent, high dose intervention.